Hello everyone. I bring you warm greetings from Accra. As you may be aware, global peace and security continue to deteriorate amid the COVID-19 pandemic, climate change, and the current Russian-Ukraine crisis. These events have had a significant impact on livelihood and human security, particularly in the, on the African continent. The West Africa sub-region in particular is currently experiencing the surge in activities by armed groups. I am happy to know that several steps have been taken to deal with these threats. However, a lot remains to be done. That is why I, Vice Admiral Seth Amuama, Chief of the Defense Staff of the Ghana Armed Forces, wish to invite you to the maiden edition of the International Defense Exhibition and Conference in Accra from 11th to 12th October 2022 under the theme Strengthening International Collaboration to Combat Terrorism and Transnational Organized Crimes. I am by this invitation calling on all stakeholders in academia, the media, industry, defense, and other government security apparatus, as well as the international community, to converge in Accra to find practical solutions to the litany of security challenges facing the region and beyond. It is my hope that by the end of the two-day event, we will collectively synchronize on strategy towards strengthening international collaboration to combat terrorism and transnational organized crime. The Ghana Armed Forces is collaborating with the Great Minds event organizers to deliver this event. Great Minds are responsible for the logistics and administrative arrangements. They will therefore be reaching out to you on the necessary arrangement. I look forward to welcoming you to Accra soon and I thank you very much. I am Major General Thomas Opompipra, the Chief of the Army Staff of the Ghana Army. It is my pleasure to warmly welcome you colleague Chiefs of the Army, former Chiefs and stakeholders in the land combat and security industry in Ghana and abroad to this year's International Defense Exhibition and Conference, also known as IDEC. This year's event, which takes place from 11 to 12 October 2022, is dubbed Strengthening International Collaboration to Combat Terrorism and Transnational Organized Crime. The event is being held under the auspices of the Ministry of Defense and the Ghana Armed Forces. The Ghana Army is delighted to be part of IDEC since it has become imperative for armies in the sub-region to unite, share ideas, brainstorm, and exhibit the capabilities we have in our collective quest for global peace. The need to also discuss modern ways of conducting our operations and acquiring modernized land combat platforms, equipment, and resources cannot be overemphasized. We as Chiefs of the Army must constantly upgrade ourselves and learn modern ways of combating crime to inspire our troops and keep them highly motivated, well-trained, and well-equipped so that we can always have quality officers and soldiers to achieve the tasks of our armies. This conference is therefore appropriate and timely. Once again, you are welcome to Accra, Ghana, and I look forward to seeing you at the conference. I am Rear Admiral Issa Adam Yakubu, Chief of Naval Staff of Ghana. I am happy to invite colleague Chiefs of Navies, stakeholders in maritime security, as well as global players in the maritime industry to the Maiden International Defense Exhibition and Conference to be held in Accra from the 11th to the 12th of October, 2022. 
the event which is being held under the auspices of the Ministry of Defense of Ghana and the Ghana Armed Forces is under the theme Strengthening International Collaboration to Combat Terrorism and Transnational Organized Crime. Through international collaboration and action by coastal states, piracy in the Gulf of Guinea has been on the decline. There is therefore the need for regional collaboration to sustain the decline. Terrorism in the Sahel is, however, on the ascendancy and fast descending southwards towards coastal states of West Africa. There is therefore the need to strengthen collaboration and leverage on strategies and technology in order to deal with the threat. That is why I am inviting all who matter in the issues of terror as well as transnational organized crime to come to Accra in October to discuss the relevant issues. Thank you very much. I am Air Vice Marshal Frank Hansen, the Chief of Air Staff of the Ghana Air Force. And I send you my warm regards from Accra, Ghana. In our determination to confront the threats facing our sub-region, I wish to invite you to the first International Defense Exhibition and Conference in Accra scheduled for 11 and 12 October. Without any doubt, the theme, Strengthening International Collaboration to Combat Terrorism and Transnational Crime, I think is appropriate. Of course, in the recent past, the rise in violent crimes, organized criminal networks, and the violent extremism continue to affect the lives and humanitarian situation of our people. As we are all aware, the global impact of the COVID-19 pandemic and the ongoing Russian-Ukrainian war also continue to deteriorate the economic and political stability of our countries. I wish to acknowledge that despite the several investments and resources to address these threats, there is still a need to bring stakeholders, including academia, industry, and defense to the modern technologies under one roof in order to foster a common approach to resolving the myriad of security challenges that we all face. Obviously, the previous International Maritime Defense Exhibition and Conference that were hosted in Ghana in the last two years have now matured into this year's conference. I am confident that this conference and exhibition will bring the various land, air, and sea power perspectives into one common but decisive strategy for all of us. I am excited, therefore, and looking forward to a successful conference, at the end of which we can confidently say, IDEC Accra has come to stay. See you in Accra, and I wish every one of you a successful IDEC 2020.